Yo, what's up, guys? This is International O. Back at it again. This shoe. Jeez Louise, man. I submitted for a raffle on this shoe on, uh, I'm going to say, February the 12th or 13th. 12th. <clears throat> February 12th is when they did the raffle for this shoe. <clears throat> Uh, the 13th, they announced a round of winners, so I thought I lost. So I was like, oh, okay, well, cool, no biggie. Then on Valentine's Day, they did another round of winners, and I was one of those winners. So that was the 14th. I think the shoe officially released on the 16th, and it shipped ground, but it didn't ship that day. It took days to ship. I just got it today. Let's put it like that. 12 days later. Well, 14 days later from when they charged my card. I just got the shoe today. So there, there it is. Let's get to it. Man, this box is beat up. Like they really did some work. Look at this box. They did some damage to this box. But it didn't damage the, the, the shoe, so that's pretty much all that matters to me, man. I'm cool with it. I'm not worried about a beat up box. Man. Trying to get this joint out of here. As you can see from the, oh, they put it on the look. Oh, I thought they put it on this paper. Duplicate copy, gave me my little receipt. And you know what it is by now, you got the little owl on it. So that's that. As you can see here, you, you get an idea of what it is. You know what I'm saying, it's the Jordan. We got the OVO 8s. <coughs> Which pair did I get? The black pair. Man. You know, I'm not really an eight guy. And the funny part about it is I submitted for the raffle for this shoe, and I honestly did not think I was going to win. I was just like, hey, I'll just do it for the hell of it. And I messed around and won. But this shoe is nice, man. It has the suede and the leather. This leather on here looks like a more of a premium leather. I don't know if you guys can see that close enough. But it looks more of like a premium leather, man, on the shoe. Uh, has the, the gold and kind of a, like a silverish accent on the shoe here along the side panels. You can see here. Then on the back of the shoe... It has the OVO logo. You can see the aisle on the back. Uh, this is nice. This is actually nice. Like I said, I'm not a big eight guy, but this shoe is actually nice. I can't front on it. I think the only thing that kind of gets me about eights is the straps. I don't know. I mean, I think, honestly, this part is dope to me. Like the front, I don't, it's just the straps. I don't know what it is about those straps. It just kind of irritate me because it's like I see people walk around with the strap hanging like that. And to me, that looks tacky as hell. And then when you strap it down, I just feel like it's a restraint on your foot. I don't know. I can't describe it. But these are actually nice. It kind of has the wax laces too. If you could tell, you can see that it got it kind of got the like the wax laces to it. This this joint is nice. This joint is nice. It was two twenty five, and then they charge you like thirty bucks for shipping for ground shipping, which is crazy to me. But it is what it is. This is a nice shoe. Then on the inside, it has the OVO logo. If you can see on the inside of the shoe here. It has the OVO logo owl on the inside. This is dope, though. I, I can't front. It's like a nice premium leather at the toe. It's a nice shoe, man. I can't take nothing away from it. You know, I'm like I said, I'm not a big eight guy, but I can't take nothing away from this shoe. It's nice. The detailing in the shoe is pretty dope. Uh, if you can see here, then it has the, the plush around the Jordan logo here on the tongue. Then on the back, it has a new buck material. This is nice. This is a nice shoe. 23 has a nice tough leather on it. This is dope. I, I think you might have to sit on ice for a little bit. I know I, I don't see myself wearing them right now. Summertime's about to happen. So it's about to be hot. I can't see myself with this shoe on in the heat. Definitely maybe in the winter. So I'm going to sit it for... Oh. Okay, on the back of this tongue, it says, welcome. 
If you can see that. Let's see what the other one says then. Oh, this one says welcome also. I thought one of them may say one thing and the other pair says something else, but they both say welcome. But dope shoe, dope release. Took a long time to get here, but I mean, it's nice. It's a nice shoe, man. Like I said, this leather is tough. It's like a nice, it's not super soft, but it's not super stiff. It's a nice quality leather. And the smell, I like these eight smell good. I know this shit sound crazy. These eight smell good though. They have a good smell to them, man. These are dope. I mean, there's nothing that I can really say about it. I'm I'm actually pretty impressed with this shoe. This is an impressive shoe. Um, I'm hearing the rumors about Drake leaving Jordan brand to go to Adidas. That has been a rumor saying that he has been having conversations with them. Um, all I can say about that is if you if that's the move you're making. I think it's unfortunate of course it's you know everybody you know jumped on the easy way with adidas i just hope that if he does make that move they don't just start throwing out like drake nmds and drake ultra boost like give him his own shoe you know what i'm saying that's the only thing i can i can say about that if that's going to be the move he makes at least give him his own shoe instead of uh, uh nmd or ultra boost i like i feel like they're kind of wearing that shit in the ground um, but that's pretty much it, man. If you like the video, go ahead and hit the like button. Also, be sure to subscribe to the page, share it with friends and family, man. I've been appreciating the love I've been getting lately. I've been getting a few more subscribers. Uh, so probably soon, I'm going to try to sneak in a giveaway for y'all, man. So y'all stay tuned for that also. And until the next release, you guys be cool.